In a magical season in which the Red Sox have defied expectations, there are many candidates on their team for MVP. But to me, there's just one name that should win the team award. The 2013 Red Sox have been incomparable. They have done things this season that no one expected them to do coming out of spring training. Yes, we all thought they'd be a better team, a playoff contender possibly, but no one expected them to rise to the top of the American League East and dominate and have comeback win after comeback win, just about one a week, every week of the season. And they've just been superb, and there have been many candidates on this team that have really deserved a chance to be called the MVP of this team. Whether it's Dustin Pedroia with his consistent hitting and fielding, Jacoby Ellsbury with the same, good hitting, excellent fielding, David Ortiz with his presence in the lineup. And these are all good candidates, but to me, there is one guy on this Red Sox team that could be and should be the MVP, and that is the current closer, Koji Uehara, who has come out of nowhere to really save the Red Sox bacon this season. And the reason is, when you lose two closers and two key pitchers in your bullpen early in the season, in Joel Hanrahan and Andrew Bailey, guys that were expected to make huge contributions to the Red Sox relief corps this year, when you lose those guys to, sh uh, to shoulder problems and Tommy John surgery early in the season, you pretty much have nowhere to go. John Farrell was scrambling, trying to find a solution at closer. He plugs in Koji Uehara after working with Junichi Tozawa a little bit and not finding much success. Farrell plugs in Uehara, and boom, the Red Sox suddenly have a shutdown closer in the ninth inning. And it's just been an amazing run. And the thing about Uehara this year is not only has he done the job, but he's been so economical in doing it. There have been so many ninth innings that he's come into and thrown 11, 12, 13, 15 pitches to close out an inning. So even though Uehara is 39 years old, he's been so economical with his pitches that there has not been a lot of wear and tear on him during the season. And that's going to be big for the Red Sox as they move into the postseason. If you can get a guy pitching in a postseason this efficiently, you know you got your ninth inning locked down. And that's a big advantage when you're in the postseason and these innings get tougher and tougher as the games get bigger and bigger. So to me, there's no bigger guy that's an MVP for the Red Sox than Uehara this season. Again, what he's done considering his age and where he came from and his emergence in the bullpen, just kind of being there and flying under the radar for a little bit. Yes, he had good times as a setup man early on in the season when he was pitching that eighth inning, but I don't think anybody could have foreseen him pitching the way he has as the closer for this ball club. And for that reason, I think it's a clear choice that Koji Uehara is clearly the 2013 MVP of the Boston Red Sox. Do you agree? Give me your thoughts and your comments about Uihara as MVP this season. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and tell all your friends about This Week in Red. And don't forget to check out my blog at BosoxInjection.com.